NBC Orchestra inviting you to join Don and his guests, Jack Flipman, Ben Vereen, Bernie Coppell, and Stan Kahn. And now, ladies and gentlemen, here's Don Rickles! On behalf of my people <laughs> and my friend General Puerta and Mayeres, General Mayeres, <laughs> on behalf of General Mayeres, who's a mute, Masena Mayen, Cayena Masena Mayen. <laughs> the same to your family. <laughs> Hate that. Gee, get rid of that out. What is that, a drip and dry suit? <laughs> Standing there like a real yo yo. Get the key off your can. You can't even walk. <laughs> Who knows wind up band leaders? <laughs> what a night, eh? What a night. My luck, eh? What a, what a night. night. I host in the middle of the summer while Carson's in Paris. Do, 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 do. I know how it goes. I don't need a dummy to help me out with the Paris number. I'll work alone, huh? Just sit there with the sticks and hope Buddy Rich sends you the book. <laughs> it's his whole life. What are you, a hunter? <laughs> One of the guys in the band keeps looking around going, I wonder if the crowd knows me. <laughs> Good to see you again, Count Igor. <laughs> this fantastic, Count Igor. I love you so much. Count. <laughs> I got blood from his neck, the crazy guy. You keep pumping this, we'll have oil in the morning. <laughs> nice to see you guys again. Yeah. Which is the guy that keeps skipping in the park looking for friends? <laughs> oh, he's a new guy. Oh. Would you rise, my friend? <laughs> what am I bid for this? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. George Washington died and he had a kid. <laughs> <laughs> you must have come out of your mother on an angle. <laughs> Look at the face on this guy. Gee, you probably hit the wall. <laughs> Is he laughing or coming towards me? A <laughs> uh, black lady in the front. Relax, honey. I make you feel good. <laughs> you show them you got rhythm. You can move into their neighborhood. But what's your first name, love? Come here, come here, honey. Come here. Put the, put the purse down. Come here, Chris. Put the purse down. Hurry up. Run, honey. Then they wonder why they can't get jobs. <laughs> come, on, come here, honey. What's your name? Chris Star. Chris Star. <laughs> I'm the Lone Ranger. <laughs> Give me. Luggage uptown. <laughs> Come on, baby. Oh, I'm so lonely. I got nothing against Africa. Oh, baby. Where are you from? Jamaica. You're from Jamaica? No, just kidding. <laughs> Get a rope. Uh, anyway, uh, what, what do you do for a living, love? Uh, starving actress. You're a starving actress? Yeah. Well, this is your chance. A white man and a black chick making love. <laughs> <laughs> you got any on me? Sit down, my darling. She's sweet. Give her a nice hand. She's a good sport. I want to thank the Manson jury sitting in the front going, I say she's innocent. Now, that takes a lot of courage. I'm going to come up and say hello to you for a minute, okay? Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> thank you again, sweetheart. Does she, does she get any sort of gift? Give her a bottle of champagne, huh? Look at this. The producer went, we're not going to go for that. That's too much. <laughs> How are you, my friend? Good. Is your cab outside? <laughs> Would you stand up? Would you do me a favor? 
<laughs> Pack them on back. Stay! <laughs> What'd you do, just come out of your house and walk right in here? Can I say something to a friend? The pants a little high in a crutch, about a half an hour. <laughs> See, that's why your eyes are closed. There's no air. <laughs> What's your name? Neil Fowler. Neil Fowler? Hi, Neil. Good luck to you. You a Jewish kid? Yes. Took a wild guess. <laughs> Hi, Mrs. Miller. How are you? Look at that. A plant's growing on her head. <laughs> God bless you, Don. I spoke to the home. You're spitting up again, Mrs. Miller. Rise. Oh, kill! Untanga, unga, humbo, hakka. Tanga, tanga. God almighty, you're a handball court. A black handball court. What do you do for a living? Lift up tables? What do you do? What do you do? Police officer. Stand up, son. What's your name, sir? Skip Klein. Skip Klein? Right. Oh, funny cop. <laughs> <laughs> Pull over. Anyway, uh, Skip, what, what are you, a patrolman? What? All right. You're in Los Angeles? No, Mansfield, Ohio. Mansfield, Ohio. Right. Oh, that's great. Yeah. I'll make you feel from, I'll make your people from Ohio feel good, okay? Ah! Five o'clock. Come on, Eddie. <laughs> we go bowling. Come on, Eddie. <laughs> Can I sit down? Sit down. I can. Stand up, I cop. I hate that. But we need police officers. You know that, Skip, and I kid you, really. I mean it. You good at judo and all that stuff? Pretty good. Pretty good, huh? How long have you been a police officer? Two years. boy. God bless you. You got a wife? No, no. I wonder why. <laughs> can you imagine him on a wedding night and he makes a move towards her? No! <laughs> She'll wake up in the morning and be a waffle for crying out loud. <laughs> Can I tell you, police officers, we make fun. But I tell you, without you guys, we'd be lost. God bless you. Give him a nice hand. It's funny. myself for a lousy hundred grand. <laughs> Hi, dear. Did you come over here? Rebecca of Sunnybrook Farm. <laughs> no, that's pretty. You can leave your hat on. <laughs> What's that? Would you like my hat? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Remember those guys? A lot of moccasins, a lot of moccasins. Gotta get off the island. <laughs> we have to go to commercial? We should. We should, okay. <laughs> What's your name, dear? Joanne Jenkins. Joanne? Joanne Jenkins. You're Irish. Italian. Italian. <laughs> you said Irish, you could have won a week at Ojai. <laughs> anyway, sit down. You made a fool of yourself. Sit down, Joanne. Hey, we got to go to a commercial, but I'd like to say <laughs> hi, sweetheart. Hi. <laughs> God, love you. <laughs> it's like sleeping with a swamp. I'll tell you this. Uh, our guests will be Jack Klugman, my good friend, Ben Vereen, one of the most talented men in the world, Bernie Capel from Don Adams World, Dottie Ob Archibald, a new star, and Stan Kanan, a funny, funny man. The Tonight Show will continue after a word from our sponsor. Thanks, Tommy. Tommy Newsom. By the way, I didn't introduce him. Tommy Newsom. And the band, guys. What? Not the first guy with the, with the looks out, but the second guy. What, I, what's his first name? Snooky. Snooky. I always forget him. Snooky, good to see you, baby. Thank you. How's the family? God bless. I spoke to Harry Goins, my man, who's also black, and he just got news he's king of Ethiopia. <laughs> 
<laughs> See, they have their own private paper, and you gotta let them know quietly, you know. Just... I know you'll, he'll have to leave shortly, Tommy, before the show's over to go to the coronation. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I'd like to, hey, Ed, good yes. to see you, sweetheart. Nice we to had see a good you, time. We were at your brother-in-law's right. wedding. Wedding, right. Which was such a great affair. Yeah. His brother-in-law, by the way, Ed's brother-in-law got married. Uh, that's his wife's brother, right. naturally, Victoria. Yes. And it was a great, we went to Senor Picos. We're not yes. to plug places, you know. No. And it was great. And we threw ourselves on a Mexican hat for about a half hour. <laughs> had a couple of belts. Right. And it was great. When you undressed and stood on top of the chair and went, Viva Zapata. <laughs> you like that. Bananas, bananas. I had a good time. Newhart kept sitting there going, I, I think it's a heck of a night. And started to drink a lamp. <laughs> But it was great. You people don't get out too much, do you, you folks here? You, you folks are all on a tour, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh. Well, when I blow the whistle, I want you to attack the girl in the front. No, it's only a joke. Anyway, uh, I must say, though, it, it, it's, it's, it's a joy to have you. You're doing a commercial now? Yes. You're skyrocketing. What? You're so busy. I mean, I'm struggling to get Thursday. You're constantly going and going and doing and running. And I'm looking for Thursday. Like a little Jewish kid wandering around the desert, like all my people do, sucking on a pebble, anything, to get lucky. <laughs> and you, you big, fat Irish bum, you just sit in the house and go, oh, another job! <laughs> another job, Victoria! And I'm sitting there, my wife's laying there with a the jewelry going, attack me, attack me. <laughs> Last night it was great, I was uh, Cochise. <laughs> Stood on top of a chair, from the sink, and boom! And she laid there and went, Geronimo's alive! Geronimo's alive! We had a hell of a night. It really was. Like well, you don't know. You and Victoria... Ed, I don't want to embarrass you, but your underwear is starting to rip. <laughs> what? Ed? Yes, I have to... Uh, I don't have to. I want to. Tonight, WJAR-TV in Providence celebrates 30 years with NBC. Their 30th anniversary. Happy anniversary, Providence. In honor of Providence, could I have a drum roll, please? Uh, if I don't, if I, I'm not bothering you, am I trying to see? He's sitting there with a nightlight reading a book. <laughs> could I have a drum roll? A drum roll. Yes, sir. Not yes, sir. Yes, great Buana, king of all Jews. <laughs> a drum roll, in honor of Providence, Providence. rise. Please. Strawberry shortcake, cuckleberry pie, V-I-C-T-O-R-Y. Are we in it? Well, I guess. Providence, Providence, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I got an uncle there. I never even stopped to see him in Tony. <laughs> the Tonight Show will continue right after we pause for a message from all of Johnny's sponsors. <laughs> oh, the lights on. Thanks, Tommy. It's a great pleasure to welcome my first guest tonight. He's a three-time Emmy winner, which he's told me time and time again. And his television series, Quincy, returns this fall for a fifth season. <laughs> On NBC. I must say, that's longer than I ever had to say the secret word. Ladies and gentlemen, my dear friend, and more important than that, a brilliant talent, Mr. Jack Klugman. <laughs> Hey, God, three-time Emmy winner. Nuts. Thanks a million for coming by. I know how your schedule. <laughs> Dynamite boy, little guy from Philly to take time out. You know, I appreciate it. That's all the zingers I'm going to take. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a break. I need everybody. Anybody, I love you. You look terrific. I kiss your hand. I kiss your toes. <laughs> whatever you want. What do you want, sir? Well, Just don't we're on the air. But, uh, <laughs> I would never zing you. May I say something as a friend? Anything you want. Think about a nose job. <laughs> I had one. Did you really? <laughs> no, I used to have a ball at the end of my nose like Carl Malden. I had to remove it. Hey, listen. Joe Scandori. Talk to him. I talked to the wall. No, no, you're not. You no, you yeah, no. We got to get to the main stuff. stuff. Uh, what are we going to talk about? Your truck driver suit? You make up my nose. Did you mention my nose? You mention my nose. I told you about my nose. No need for me to get hot, is there? <laughs> turned on me like Hitler was my son. <laughs> Just was a little a guy. <laughs> 